today is we're going to demonstrate that the Bulldog Scrubber cleans faster and it cleans better than a mop and bucket. So our idea is we're going to, we took a mat which we're going to we divide it in half. Um, we're going to uh, clean both sides, one with the Bulldog, the other with the mop and bucket. When we're all done, we're going to take a couple of swabs of, of either side and we've got some petri dishes over here that we're going to use to grow cultures and prove that the Bulldog cleans better. Gentlemen, start your engines. You could have done another pass, Rick. Yeah. All right. So we'll let that dry and then we'll come back and do some swabs. All right, so we got a couple of uh, cotton swabs and we're gonna take a swab test of each side. So we'll go ahead and do that. Okay, put them in our little petri dish here. We'll come back in a few days and see what we have. Hi, how you doing? Here we are a week later and our bacteria has been busy growing in the petri dishes which are over here on the counter. What do you say we go take a look at them? If you remember, uh, we scrubbed one side of the mats uh, with the bulldog scrubber, which this is represented by this petri dish here, and the other side of the mat with mop and bucket. So if we take the lids off, look inside, you can see the one with the bulldog scrubber has very little bacteria growth at all. You can see where we rub the swab, but no substantial bacteria growth. On the mop and bucket side, you can see we've got all kinds of nasty stuff growing in there. Now, I got a C- minus in biology in high school, so I'm not sure what any of that stuff is. But from what I've read, you know, the kind of things that can be found on mats include staph, MRSA, things that could give you rashes, athlete's foot, all kinds of scary stuff. If you want to do a test like this in your own facility, you can order these Petri dishes online and uh, take a swab. Maybe after you clean your mats, let it sit for a week or two and see what you got going on. Our point is, when you use a bulldog scrubber, you're always cleaning the mat with clean water. And then we suck it up with the squeegee in the back. That's the whole point. With a mop and bucket, remember, when you put that dirty mop back in the bucket, you're just redistributing the filth around your gym. So, um, looks like the experiment worked, and it looks like the bulldog scrubber is the best way to sanitize your mats.